good morning. Good morning, everyone. I praise the Lord for this day. I've got a word to share with you this morning here. I was reading the very familiar story when Jesus walked on water in Matthew 14. And there's one scripture that really spoke to me this morning, and I think it's going to minister to some of you. And it's, um, like I said, it's chapter 14 and verse 27 here. And it reads, But Jesus spoke to them at once, saying, Don't be afraid. Take courage. I am here. Wow. Wow. You know, when, when Jesus makes this proclamation, the disciples were in a very dangerous situation. They were out in the water in the middle of the night when suddenly a strong storm comes and causes the water to become very rocky and, and unsafe. We all know the story. As they are trying to stabilize the boat and fight the waves, they begin to see a figure moving towards them and are terrified at first as they thought it was a ghost. The disciples are fearful, not knowing if they'll ever make it back to safety and how the story is going to end for them. But Jesus, in the midst of the chaos, appears and says, Don't be afraid. Take courage. I am here. The disciples had no reason to fear. Jesus had been aware the whole time, and he was not going to let them perish. And as this scripture says, Jesus came right on time with the word they needed. And maybe that's where you are this morning, that you need to hear from Jesus. The very thing that could be looking like it's the worst possible problem for you. Maybe the thing the Savior uses to deliver you. What you may see as a source of great fear. Maybe Jesus' way of saying to you, don't be afraid, take courage, I am here. We know, guys, that trials have a way of clouding our vision so that we may not really be able to see what you think you're seeing. That's why we must always look to Jesus Take a hold of his promises and trust that he sees what you're going through and that he will bring you through. So let me remind you this morning, if that's where you are, that your circumstances are no sweat for Jesus. He can walk right over the top of your storm because he's bigger than your problems. He wants you to learn that you can face your enemy on the outside because as a follower, Jesus is with you on the inside. Well, guys, just a quick word of encouragement. I hope it does speak to your heart. If it does, please share this video. Hope you have an awesome day. Know that I love you guys and I'm praying for you.